The message from authorities is they aren't giving up on the search for now six-year-old Summer. Hawkins County Sheriff Ronnie Lawson says they aren't going to stop until she's found. It's heartbreaking to me and my officers and the entire community. We've never stopped looking for Summer. We'll continue to do so. TBI spokeswoman Leslie Earhart says it's hard to believe the search has been ongoing for a year. When we held the first media briefing on June 16th, honestly, we expected to have good news to report by the time the next media briefing came around. Unfortunately, instead, day after day ended in frustration. Authorities say this case is outside the norm and all possibilities are being explored. Numerous search warrants have been executed, cell phone data, has been analyzed and any other available digital evidence has been collected, searched and documented. With this investigation garnering attention across the nation, Earhart stresses people only report credible tips. This has had a major impact on the investigation and not in a good way. Moving forward, we ask the public not to submit tips as a result of a video they viewed on YouTube or a theory they've seen posted on Facebook. Please help us and only call if you have direct, specific information about the disappearance of Summer. With those in the community, hopeful Summer will be found. Joseph Broadwater and Haley Justine Thompson said it's important to not give up. We're praying for you. We want you to come home. We want to see you reunited with your family and the loved ones in the community. Just would love to be able to celebrate you coming home. Summer Moon Utah Wells, we just love you so much. We're hoping that you come home soon, safely. Uh, so many people want to share their love with you, and we're going to continue to pray for you until you are found. Law enforcement promise this case hasn't gone cold. It's been the goal of this team since day one to find Summer. We've never stopped, we've never slowed down, we deal with it every day.